Google just released a powerful new feature in Bard, which now allows anybody to create AI generated images for free. In the next two minutes, I'll show you how you can access this free image generator. And I'll share a few prompting techniques and nuances that I've learned, which will help you to get the best results. Let's go ahead and dive into it. To get started, just go ahead and log into your Google account and then go to bard.google.com. And to create an image, just type into the text box at the bottom of the screen, create an image of, and then type in the subject or the topic of whatever image you'd like to create. So I'm gonna type in of a cat. All right, and here we have some images of cats. And if you'd like to download any of the images, you can just click on the download icon in the upper right hand corner of the image. But here we go. And the quality really isn't that bad. However, I will say that in my experience, I do believe the quality of let's say Mid Journey or Dolly is quite a bit better, but I do believe that Bard will get some upgrades pretty soon and actually be fairly competitive. But from here, if you'd like to further customize your images, you can just continue chatting with Bard and uh, provide whichever details you'd like to add into the image. So for example, I'm gonna type in, make the images of smiling cats on a sunny day. <laughs> All right, and there we have some images of some smiling cats. Now, it's not as sunny as I would have hoped, but I think you get the point. You can just continue chatting with Bard and really create whatever images you would like. Now, as far as a few nuances, I'm gonna go and show you a few images that I already created and a few things that I learned along the way. So for example, something that I learned is that you can't request to create images of people in Bard. It will give you errors if you try to do that. And additionally, uh, it's if you'd like to create, let's say icons, you can just type in uh, create an image icon representing the subject or topic. So for example, right here, I typed in create a black and white image icon representing a computer. And this is what it came up with. So that's really all you need to know for now about Bard. Again, it's really easy to use and it's a fantastic way to go and start generating images for free.